So back in September, we bought a van. It is an incredibly exciting moment. I'm the proud owner of this new Chevy Express passenger van, it's a 15 passenger van, and we are doing a full conversion on it here coming in the coming months. So it is time to transition kind of out of the bus into something a little bit more drivable. But yeah, this is, this is gonna be the rig. This is welcome to the first look at the public land van. As you can see, it's the uh, extended model. So it's like a 155 inch wheelbase, but already got one seat pulled out back there. We got 15 passenger. This thing is gonna be mean. First step is getting it out to Pennsylvania where we are doing a four wheel drive conversion on it from Quigley Motor Company. So I will explain more details on that in just a second. So here we go. All right. Now we own a 15 passenger van. I'm gonna go take it in somewhere, get the van serviced, make sure everything, all the fluids are looking good. And then um, actually gonna be driving this thing to Pennsylvania this weekend. So the first step is we're gonna convert the van to four wheel drive and we're doing that through Quigley Motor Company out in Pennsylvania. They have been around since the 60s converting vans like this and others into four wheel drive systems. So they turn into an incredibly capable, capable vehicle. So four wheel drive conversion, lift, tires, the whole thing basically turning this into the ultimate hunting van uh, just step by step. So first step is make sure all the fluids are good, just kind of give it a once over before I set off on a 1700 mile journey. So that is step one. I'm gonna go take care of that right now and then um, figure out what the next step is. This morning, I just finished up my 1700 mile drive out to Manchester, Pennsylvania to the Quigley Motor Company. So the reason I brought it out here is that this van is going to get a little bit of an overhaul. So we're converting it from two wheel drive to four wheel drive and Quigley is gonna do that over the next couple weeks. And by the time we get it back, it'll be lifted, have BF Goodrich tires on it and a four wheel drive system, making it unbelievably capable in the back country and uh, one step closer to the ultimate hunting rig. But yeah, the next time we're out here, this van will look a whole lot different than it does right now. Not really on the interior. Um, we're gonna do the whole build out on the interior ourselves. Josh and I will do that. But the exterior, uh, it'll be lifted, it'll have tires and a four wheel drive system. So super excited to drop this thing off here and work with the awesome people at Quigley, basically turning this van into an like crazy capable van um, that we'll be able to use instead of using a pickup. So it's going to be fun to do the whole build out on this thing and then see what it can do over the next year. So it's been almost a month since I dropped the van off in at Quigley out here in PA. And I just landed back in Harrisburg. Uh, Brent Hawk of Quigley is actually picking me up. So I am just about to walk outside and it's the first time I'll be seeing the van with the lift and the new tires. Uh, and I'll get to check out the four-wheel drive system. So pretty excited about that um, Got BFG 33 inch BFG tires on it now uh, It looks a whole lot meaner than it did when I dropped it off. So I can actually see him coming down I can see him coming down the aisle right now All right first impressions. Oh, the thing looks good Yeah, buddy Look at that thing Sweet. Oh, that looks good. So this is Brent Hawk of Quigley. Uh, he drove the van up to pick me up. And now I get to drive it 1,300 miles uh, back west for Short now. Short distance. <laughs> Short distance, yeah, real quick trips. So let's check it out. So I am out in Pennsylvania. I have picked up the rig. The four-wheel drive conversion's done. The new tires are on. It looks awesome. It's time to hit the road and head. First trip is 1,300 miles, so here we go. 